hand of God. I know a 14-year-old child, 14-year-old boy, whose mom decided to change his gender. Correct. Because he doesn't like his weenie. <laughs> hand of God, true story. Am I, that's a 14-year-old child. Have you ever seen a 14-year-old boy? First of all, they're not even fully developed. Some, some, they got long torsos. They got a big overbite with acme in the side of their head. <laughs> Playing with a ball by himself. <laughs> Always saying, my bad, my bad. <laughs> my bad. Dad, I burnt down the shed by accident. <laughs> my bad. <laughs> Can I cut my weenie off? Let the, let the children at least become adults before they can make a decision like that. And listen, if that's what you're gonna do, I'm all for you, man. Knock yourself out. You're, knock yourself out. I will, I will beg you, especially if you're a boy, just think about every angle. You may think you wanna be a female, when I was growing up, there were transvestites, and they, that's a lot of work. I have a lot of respect for the transvestite. That's a lot of work. I gotta put on shoes and pants and girdle and the lipstick and wig, and I'm selling this today. That's a lot of work. But at the end of the day, you still do what you want. I'm begging any child that's thinking about <laughs> and injecting safe hormones. <laughs> Just think of tiny little things like the first time you go to a concert outdoors and it's muddy out, you gotta piss in a porta potty. You might wanna speak to females before you jump into that. You know what I mean? I'm so glad I'm a female now. Oh God. Sister, you don't wanna come in. You don't wanna go in there, it's disgusting. There's vomit all over the place. Uh, there's, there's turds and blue thing and there's flies. Uh, I wish I had a penis. I could just pee anywhere. Uh, I would die to have a penis right now. You don't want to be going, damn it, I should have been a transvestite. Damn it. 